everyone, thank you for joining me for my ways to wear the trench coat styling video. I hope this can be a little bit of a distraction for you with some fun fashion for a few minutes and some spring summer outfit inspiration. I will be styling up a trench coat from Mint Velvet. It was very kindly gifted by Brands at Next. It will be linked in the description box with everything else in this styling video and I will also leave a few of my favourite affordable trench coats on the high street because for me it really is a great spring summer wardrobe staple that you can reach for again and again every year so let's get into today's video. This is the outfit that inspired the video so these pieces were kindly also gifted by labels from Next so you will find all of these items at Next Official so they also stock the brands basically. So on the top I have this beautiful mint velvet top and look how amazing these sleeves are. I'm just so obsessed. It feels really nice and fitted, nice rib knit, nice flattering neckline and then just some puff statement sleeves. I hope the lighting's okay by the way, I can't really tell. But moving down to my jeans, these are from Whistles and they are so comfortable. I've never tried Whistles jeans before. They're nice and high waisted but also loose while staying pretty fitted around the bum. And then we have a raw hem edge down to my new sandals which are from Topshop. Super comfortable, wanted to be inspired for a bit of spring and summer so I picked these up, real leather bottoms and super affordable. With that, I have just paired my Balenciaga mini city bag. I recently did a handbag video actually, so I will leave that also linked if you wanna see my handbag collection. But I thought I would show you the base outfit first before popping on the trench coat. This is with the beautiful trench coat on, which just feels amazing, feels really luxurious. And I just love the sleeve detailing. It's a classic statement, but a little bit modern it feels. I got a UK size 10 and I feel like this fits me perfectly on the body. The material feels really nice and soft, but also structured. I don't feel like it would crease too much because that's something you have to watch out for with trench coats, but just paired with a simple white top, black jeans, sandal combo. This is definitely a go-to for spring, summer for me. That is minimal trench coat outfit number one. Second outfit is based around this amazing Bauchian top, which you might have seen in a day in the life vlog that I did a while ago, that obviously is not a day in my life at the moment. A day in the life is in the house, so if you want an update my daily routine and quarantine, let me know. Then I'm wearing my Senrev Aria belt bag with this, and my Levi's denim skirt, which is gonna be a godsend for spring, summer. And on my tootsies, I have the chunky boots from my recent misguided horse. So I'll leave that one linked for you guys as well. But this is the base of the second outfit. Again, neutrals minimal. And I think that chunky boots just are really flattering on the leg. Make your legs look super slim, toned, amazing. So I will just pop the trench coat over the top. I love how obviously the colors work really well together with the nude colors in the top that are obviously brought out in the trench. We've got black buttons that go with the black in the rest of the outfit. I also love the play on lengths with the short skirt and the long trench coat. So I think they look really nice paired together, very kind of chic look. And also I'm kind of matching with the print inside of Le Jacquette. I love this outfit and I'm really sorry, these are old Zara cargo trousers from last year that I didn't give as much airtime as I should have and they're really figure flattering so I will try and find some similar ones that tie at the ankle and then they obviously come in at the waist so they balloon out a little bit but they give a really nice silhouette. On my feet I am wearing my Nasty Girl Toe Thong sandals, so comfortable, manageable heel with a, another piece from Zara which is new this season and this little cute ribbed top which was really super affordable. I've just paired with it my Prada bag so we shall pop on the trench coat to complete the look. Again I just love how all of the neutrals work really well together. I mean you really can't go wrong with neutrals, they just pair so well which is why the majority of my wardrobe is black, white and beige. But this is a little bit more dressy but not too dressy. I mean you can change the shoes with it, you could also pair this with trainers to make it a little bit, a little bit more casual. But it's just again a very chic minimal trench coat outfit. I like to call this my tennis coach outfit and you'll see why. I just have on a plain t-shirt from Topshop which is my favourite place to buy basic tees. 
you know, I love a bit of top shop. Then I have this beautiful skirt, which is from Whistles. I love the kind of origami layering details on it. It is really old. I've had it for three, well, four or five years, maybe actually. So I'll try and find something similar linked, but I just love the silhouette it brings. It comes in at the waist and flares out as well. Then down to my shoe combo. I'm wearing my favourite socks, of course, my Nike sports socks with a new pair of Lacoste trainers, which are so comfy. And I'm kind of loving the resurgence of runner trainers over big chunky trainers. Then I have my Sen Rev Mini Maestro bag, which again you will have seen in my handbag haul. So this is a very kind of sports athleisure type of vibe. But again, once I put the trench coat on, which I will do now, you can see how it's a nice play on lengths. This is the look with the trench coat over. I really do love the trench coat paired with any type of skirt or dress. Like I said before, I just love the play on lengths. Can't go wrong with a monochrome base. All the outfits I've shown you today, you can mix and match together as well. I'm just gonna kind of push a minimal wardrobe with not too many colors in there just so you get the most wear out of all your items. But I think I'm loving this one the most. It's got a very Scandi vibe to it and I really do love a Scandi style at the moment. For my last look, we're going a little bit more glam. The way you could dress up a trench coat is with a beautiful slip style dress. Now this is from Chi Chi London. It's very kindly gifted and the fit of this is just so stunning, so flattering. It's in polka dot, which is a big trend for spring summer. We have a really nice cowl neck here. We have adjustable straps, brings you in at the waist. And I feel like splitting up the polka dot really kind of thins the silhouette and then we have a slight asymmetric trim so it's such a gorgeous dress very versatile you could dress it down with trainers but also be great for weddings races events and things like that absolutely adore this i've got it paired with some of their sandals which are a really manageable heel i also like the fact it's a block heel i find them so much easier to walk in and this super cute bag that i just thought the pearls in it really match the polka dot in the dress so it's a really nice kind of occasion wear piece but I think that trench coats are great as occasion wear outerwear which is why I wanted to include this in the video so I'll just pop the trench coat on so you can see what it looks like together. This is the trench coat over the dress I just think it's a really nice occasion wear coat. It's really light as well, so you know it's easy to take off if you're going to church or a wedding and you've got a little bit warm. It's easy to take off and hold and things like that. And I just think, again, it's a real timeless classic, the trench coat. Let me know in the comments below which of these has been your favourite. Also, I'd love if you subscribed, if you were new, and if you've got any fashion content you want to see from me, do let me know as well in the comments. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. I hope you did. I hope it took your mind off things. And I just think the trench coat is a wardrobe staple. If you asked me to do a spring summer wardrobe staples, which I can do if you want me to, then a trench coat would definitely be in it. It's worth the investment, I think personally. But I will leave some more videos on the screen from me if you have got more time that you want to watch and distract yourself. And I will see you guys very soon. Thanks for watching. Bye.